you pray with me? Holy, holy, holy is the Lord of hosts. The earth is filled with his glory. And dear God, we come into your presence this morning with a holy sense of, of awe. Dear God, we uh, praise you that you are the omnipotent, the omniscient, the omnipresent God who loves and cares and is filled with mercy. We praise you, dear God, that you've allowed us to construct this sanctuary. And we praise you, dear God, that you've placed leaders among us who had vision and wisdom and faith to lead us in this, in this building. We praise you, dear God, that your people were faithful and sacrificed in order that it might be accomplished. We praise you, dear God, that even as you walk into this place, there is a sense of worship that enters into the heart. And so it is, dear God, that we dedicate this sanctuary to you and we dedicate ourselves. Jesus Christ is the foundation. Jesus Christ is the cornerstone. Jesus Christ is the capstone. And we pray, dear God, that as we and those who come in the years ahead seek to serve you, that it would do in a way, that we would do it in a way that would glorify and honor and magnify the name of Jesus Christ. And so, dear God, we pray that you would bless this sanctuary as it becomes a house of worship and prayer for your people. We pray that you would bless those who teach us, and those who sing your praises. We pray that you would bless those who minister us in so many different ways in this church. We pray that you would bless the preachers, that they would have a freedom, have a boldness. They would have a, a power of the Holy Spirit as they proclaim the good news of Jesus Christ. We pray that you would bless the strangers that come seeking salvation and love and fellowship, that they would find it in abundance. We pray, dear God, that you would bless your people as they seek your righteousness, that they would be fulfilled, pressed down and overflowing. We pray, dear God, that you would bless this day and all of its activities. And now unto him who is able to exceeding abundantly do all those things above what we are able to ask or think according to the power that worketh within us. Unto him be the glory in the church by Christ Jesus throughout all ages, world without end. And we pray this prayer and hold it in the powerful, precious name of Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. 